We're going to take a look at Jangle, a folksy new addition to our guitar lineup. It's also great for rock and country styles. It's a compact library, so it's perfect for use with a laptop. Jangle does require the full version of Contact. If you have any of our more recent libraries, you will recognize the interface. There are two playing modes, Solo and Strum. Jangle includes two mic setups, a wide stereo pair, and a single mic for mono. If you have both of these on, you are actually hearing three mics. There are also faders to control the balance. 12 string mode adds yet another level of jangliness. In solo mode, you can use key velocity, key switches, or both to control articulations. This grid in the center allows you to set articulations for high and low velocity ranges and set the velocity switch points. Set the high velocity articulation on the left and the low velocity on the right. Velocities in between these two zones just play sustains. Key switches override the velocity settings. Articulations are hammer-ons, pull-offs, up and down trills, bends, mutes, and harmony. The More Settings panel lets you tweak the articulations. The Master Key knob is important because it sets the intervals for things like hammer-ons and trills, as well as the harmony. Speaking of harmony, you can trigger it with key velocity, a key switch, or just latch it on with the harmony button. There are several options for harmony, but steel is my personal favorite. Okay, on to strum mode. Strumming is easy. There are down strums, up strums, so you can play a pattern just by alternating between the two. You can get very expressive, realistic strumming this way. Or, if you play down in this octave, you get an automated strumming pattern. I can stop the pattern by playing one of the single down or up strums. The patterns are arranged in 10 locations, which are selectable with key switches. In each location, you can choose a preset pattern. The strength slider controls the overall intensity of the strums, and it can be automated to provide real-time control. Let's look at the chords themselves. I'm selecting the chord variations simply by playing the root note in one of the playing zones. I can just choose the chord variations for each root note here. I can also change them using key switches, so I can get any chord at any point in a sequence. If you don't like the way a chord is fingered, you can change any note on any string by clicking and dragging.
you can easily transpose by using the capo feature. You can arpeggiate the chords. Well, that's a quick run through of Jangle Acoustic Guitar. Thanks for watching.